Hi everyone! In this tutorial, I will show you how to add a gradient border to a button, then add animation to it, then apply the animated gradient border on hover. As you can see, we have here a simple web page that contains a button with simple styling. So what I'm gonna do now is first add a gradient border to this button. In order to do that, first I need to update the button border color to be transparent. As you can see here, I have added a sudo element after, and what I'm going to do now is add a background. This background will serve as the border color, so this one needs to be a linear gradient. You can decide on what colors to add here. Next, we need to calculate for the height. So the height is 100% plus the border width, so minus 3 pixels multiplied by 4. The width is also the same. Next, we need to calculate for the top position. So that will be the negative value for the border width multiplied by 2. The left position will also be the same. So to prevent the linear gradient from covering the bottom, we need to add a z-index property here. And that should be negative. And for the linear gradient to be a border, we need to add a position relative to the button. And lastly, we also need to add a radius, a border radius to the button after. There. Now we have a button with gradient border. And now that we have added a gradient border to the button, let's now add animation. So we need here to add an animation property. So let's name it animate. Duration, should, let's add one sec. Time function is, let's not add delay. Iteration should be infinite. Then direction should be alternate. Let's not use the fill mode. So we'll need to add action to this animate. Let me just update this one. Let's add action to the animate. So from, so let's use the background position. This one from 0% to 50%. So for the two, let's, add here 100% and 50%. So as you can see, it is not yet moving. That's because we have not yet added the background size here. So let's add this one and let's make it 200%. There. Finally, now that we have added an animated gradient border to the button, let's now apply it on hover. Since we're going to apply this on hover, We'll need to add hover here and then let's apply the border color on ho button hover. So border color transparent and we'll need to add a solid color here. You can use any color so I'll just use this one and then to make it more fun I'll just add a transition for the letter spacing. And letter spacing here. So let's try now. There. So that ends this tutorial. I hope you have learned something new from this video.